Welcome back. I made it 10 feet. I didn't do any shopping yet because uh, I clicked on one thing and Sigrin was just like, I want to go steal it. Did you see the top fingers twitching so much shiny? Yeah, it's, it's, this is happening. So, uh, anyway, you can buy anything you want. I know better than to nick any of this. I was just remembering. Growing up castless in Dust Town, we took what we could get when we could get it. But that doesn't excuse what I was. A thief and a lying rotten duster. Let's move along before the temptation becomes too great. I've only so much self-control. Great. Well, I'll be right back as I go do all of that shopping now. Hey, right, welcome to what was supposed to be the actual start of the episode. Let's head into the lion thing. What the hell was the name of this place? Fuck it, it's the lion and thing now. This is not me. Oh, gotta go to the back door. Clear out something in the basement. Church told me to. Was it the church? Or was it a merchant quest? Hey, it doesn't matter. Somebody told me to. It's not gonna go in this hole. Who kills some things? Well, these uh, rat seemed a little bit more ugly and bipedal than I expected. There's a mage, there's a mage, there's a mage, there's a mage. I'm gonna gut him like a fish. Good fishy. Yeah. I just hate it when you deep bone and there's only one gold left after. Thief. Who the hell was the thief? Oh, look a rat. Hi, little buddy. You have fun now. Very well. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Is that really all that's here? That's all that's left to... I can't do anything despite the rats. I don't think I'd want to. They're adorable little bastards. Alright, well, back to the end. Yeah, you, you be off then. Glad to see that the Genlocks apparently just don't kill them with rats. That's at least one animal we know will survive if they fuck up the planet. I'm pretty sure they fuck with dogs, though. But that might be because dogs will definitely bite them. The rats will too. The rats will run first. And they're used to fighting dogs because they fight for elders. And, uh, well, Frog likes to use their dogs. They're new for the Warhounds. Um, I think it was the Merchant's Board. I'm gonna go to the Merchant's Board, turn the quest. Hold on. Yeah, it's Kendrick. That's Kendrick. Okay, I was right. Do 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 do. do. Didn't waste my time. Hi. So good to see you again. It yeah. seems I owe you a reward. Yes. Yes. yes of course. <laughs> anyway. Feels weird, bro. Oh, uh, one of the things I did while shopping. I uh, found the Spirit Warrior Handbook. Bought it up. So now, my character also is a Spirit Warrior, which is added. These four abilities that I get to buy, which are Beyond the Veil, Daunting Cloak of Mystical Energy for the Fade, in order to evade substantial proportion of physical attacks. Neat. Soul Brand Passive. <laughs> can you do the Spirit World, but Beyond the Veil's active, the warrior gains a moderate chance of resisting hostile spells and attacks now deal spirit damage. And bypassing enemy armor. Ooh. Uh, warrior bursts with energy drawn from the other side of the veil, dealing spirit damage to all enemies nearby. Particularly harming creatures from the Fade. The amount of damage depends on the warrior's willpower attribute. Friendly fire is possible. <sighs> I think I have a pretty high will because I have a lot of things that cost stamina. And lastly, Blessing of the Fade. The warrior is able to draw strength from the benevolent spirits of the Fade. Will be on the veil's act the warrior's chance of resistance spells increases further. And the warrior gains bonus to move speed and attack speed. This is horrifying. I love it. I knew I didn't want to give, the, give my character Berserker or... Revenant, because it just didn't seem to fit with the other classes. Like, Champion Templar, Champion Guardian, that doesn't really uh, mesh well. Maybe Templar, but I, I just hate the Templars. I hate them so much. Um, yeah, 
this is really all it is. I have no use for the Templar abilities. In this game. I will say that. In this game, I have no use for the Templar abilities. In, um... Dragon Age Inquisition... The ability to just not uh, negate spells in an area is very useful in that one. I find it much more useful there than I do here. Anyway, to the old Stark's farm. Let's confront some traitors. In, uh, in a moment. Oh, well, I guess we're just going right into it, huh? Alright, let's do this! Leroy! Jenkins! Lord Guy, I fucking guessed it. Hello, sir. And Lady Liza! Ah, oh, I could just scream. Boop. Hey, Siggy, you wanna go deal with that, please? Thank you. I got these guys. Good, good job. Anders, why? Okay. I'm honestly surprised that um, Lady McDillhole's pruny face don't help the people defend my home instead isn't over here with the conspirators. I want to say like Annabella or something, but that's not right. I remember. They're all ability. It's just so dumb. Um, we needed to up something with you. What was it? Strength? Willpower? Alright, we'll find out. Do 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 Lacerates. Oh, was, what's that? Uh, shadow eventually. Oh wait, no, we're not grabbing Lacerate. We don't care about those. That's right. That's right. We need dexterity for Rain of Arrows. Alright, cool. Uh, you know what? How far off am I? That's... There's no point in redoing that. Uh, Feign Death, Lethality, Teenies, Death Game Bonus. For all attacks, the Slammer's Cunning Sword is greater than Strength. Shepherd's Violence, Energy is Cunning Modifier to Protect. Yes! Yes, his Cunning Modifier is much bigger than his Strength. Yes, it is. What did I. Oh, it did, un it did uncheck this one. What's the problem? All right, Anders, what are we giving you? There's more willpower. I'm try and catch that up to your magic a bit. Um, propulsion fields, handy. Ones of chaos. So we want to choose with you. It makes me actually interested in looking through it. Mages have way more to do with each level up. We want to look through. Warriors and Rogues is like, you've picked your weapon? Good! You're set! And that's, that's it, there you go. <clears throat> Once you run out of those skills, just buy your base ones, I guess. Yeah, let's go to Pulsion Field. So that's it. We just murder some guys. A lady. And, uh, everything's hunky-dory. Another new one, uh, alright, cool. Off we go! Very well. Success! Um, actually, hold on. That actually. Well, the quest seems to be gone. So I have a feeling. Yeah, Bruin Conspiracy is done. Okay. Onwards! To. I'm trying to debate. See, each. We go there, we get one companion. If we go here, we get a different companion. Both require uh, work. Let's do this one. I feel like I'm gonna get along with his character more than I will get along with the Wending Wood recruit, which has happened. All of my icons jumped around as if something had happened. It's not. Ah, that's a welcoming sight. We got a Lego owl up there. And wolves. Old sign. Yeah. 
Rigged old sign reads, Beware, the Black Marsh is haunted. Well, okay. I'm scared. Do, 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 Split you in half. It's also just a marsh wolf. This is, as much as they look like blighted wolves, they aren't, technically. I find that interesting. Um, bam! Well, it's supposed to, like, kill lessers. Automatically killing nearby enemies of lower lesser ranks when critical hit against the elite target. As you say. Ah. Has it killed a single thing? I shall do it. Rash. Very well. The Black Marsh itself. It. My father used okay. to tell me stories about the Black Marsh when I was young. He said evil magic killed everyone here. This was just before the rebellion. A great mystery at the time. They never found out what happened here. Once the monsters appeared, the marsh was abandoned. I You're used to dream of coming to the Black Marsh and setting things right. Little boy dreams. Well... You're doing it now, aren't you? So I am. If someone had told me I'd end up here, I would have laughed at them. Yeah. But times change. When I was in Kirkwall, I thought I would return to Ferelden to take command of my father's garrison. Now, here I am, a Grey Warden and fighting both Darkspawn and demons. Interesting. Yeah, sometimes plans are good to just ditch and go with the flow. Sometimes. Sometimes. Not always. So yeah, it just happens all the time. And the fun never ends, I suppose. Good to know. Anyway, the haunted marsh awaits. All right. Well, uh, onwards. How do you stand hey, Blood Lotus. But also, more Wolfie. Blood Lotus is one of the things we need for the, uh, the golem armor. Hey, uh, Siggy, I love you. Where's your spider? Let me, let me help with that. There we go. Well, that seems to have... Did I... Did I just hit Siggy with my axe? I don't know. I don't know if Siggy would be okay with me. The nickname Siggy. But I feel like her not being okay with it would be the quickest way to make Anders use it. If I'm being entirely honest. Well, I guess everything's dead. <clears throat> um... Blood Lotus, Marsh Wolf, Rash Vine. I think I took damage or something. A skeleton, empty poison bottle, and a tattered leather. Well, uh, first clue: You are my hen, the mistress of my flock. You nourish my body and tend to my rooster. Found the remains of an, a man named Corin, who drank poison after his lover, Bonnie, left him. A note found in Corin's skeletal hand indicates Bonnie was upset over a trail of riddles. Well, considering the first riddle is literally, you jerk me off, I, uh, I can see why she might be upset. Well, let's find more clue. Oh, well, never mind. There's the hidden clue number one. What's up this way? Dragonbone. Oh, ho, 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 yeah. Is I can't remember if I. Dragon was scattered by some animal. Yeah. Something worse. I remember my ancestor. Bone slot. There are several more. Um, how many more? Look at the dragon, but it's still missing four bones. Four more bones. And we can't go through here. It looks more like a weird black fog, but sure. Let's go with a hole in the very air itself. <clears throat> Those are basically the same thing. If you really don't think about it. Oop, can't go in there. Map lied to me again. Uh, hidden clues over there, yeah, because that's where the cocks live, of course. It's been dead for days. Well, that's a good sign. That, I suppose. The dark spawn are definitely here. No way. So we already just deduced that. Blighted werewolves? Ah, shit. 
Why are you weaker than the wolves I fought before this? You are so weak. Bring your friend in so I can... There we go. Oh, okay. You were elite at least. Okay. Oh, there's more. Okay. It's real. That's a problem. Oh, no. Not more of them. What will we do? You guys are killing them, right? Yeah? Okay, cool. <clears throat> I'm just gonna keep looting the bodies. Hidden clue! Lost beneath the trees, he lifts a wary head and sees... Okay. It's fast as fuck. Uh, lifts a weary head and sees her burning love lights his way home. Lifts... Lost beneath the trees, he lifts a weary head and sees... So this is obviously not here. I have to go to... It's lost in the trees. Uh, I think... All right, well, it's not marking hidden clue anywhere, so I guess it's not here. Cat gut! I like the leathery cord for which a craftsman has many uses. Well, that's probably used for something. Eventually. Ancient letter. What? Oh, I'm sorry. I have to read a letter. Oh, my God. Fine. I'll hit him. Boop. And boop. Well, at least these ones seem to have more health. But there's still nothing. So, ancient letter. Ancient notes. It appears we lost many times, many years ago. The burden of guilt. Merchant in the Black Marsh betrayed several young women in exchange for treasures from the Baroness. Overpowered by guilt, he soon killed himself. Merchant suicide note contained a map to his hidden cache. And that's in here? Uh, quest related? Bonnie's angry. Oh! This is the note for the wife. Uh, for the, the one who left him. Corn, is our relationship a joke? Am I a joke to you? What am I supposed to think waking up to this love note? Follow my trail of love, my darling. You are my hen, the mistress of my flock. You nourish my daughter and tend to my... Really, Corn? I tend to your rooster? That's the most disgusting thing I've heard in my entire life. You said there was a surprise waiting for me. I'm supposed to follow your trail. Ugh, I despise you. I adore you, you petty, ill-made wart. You said last week that everything would be different for us. But you're right. I'm leaving. With venom and spite, Bonnie. Harsh, but fair. What a day. First, I need some wool padding working... What? Oh, this is a different thing entirely. I thought I was hoping this would be the suicide note, but no. No, where's the suicide note? I desperately want to read it. Uh, Anders, no. Daniel, cigarette, no. We're just getting more from them. Culture and history. Ding. At least we got some good music to go with this, right? Nope. Uh, magic religion. Nope. Creatures. That's just the blooded werewolf. Oh, I don't know where the suicide note went. New codex. Did it by chance just get added now? Is that why I couldn't see it? Something last will and testament. I got no way of searching. Oh, it's this one. Oh. They came to me for help. These three maidens of the Black Marsh. They were young, beautiful, vital, everything she desires. They gave me gold, jewels, and family heirlooms. I imagine their mothers, fathers, uncles, and brothers <sighs> pressing those treasures into their hands enough to ransom a life promised to their bayonets. I agreed to spirit them away from Black Marsh. She learned of it. She appeared the night before. Her eyes were like flat, dull stones. Her hair was stringy and streaked with gray, and I saw why she needed the women. I hid them in my wagon. The youngest embraced me before she crawled between the bales of hay. She said, Baker, bless you and watch over you. I drove them to the crossroads where the Baroness men waited. He took the wagon. Their families never knew. The witch, as good as a word, brought me a chest of gold. She twirled like a little girl, eyes now sparkling. You earned every bit, merchant. The gold was no comfort. 
I saw their faces on each sovereign. Heard their voices and the tinkling of the coins. I couldn't bear it. I buried it all in the deepest part of the marsh. Still, I found no peace. There'll be no peace for me until I stand before the Maker. Brutal! I'm really glad I read that one. That was a great story. Oh, hey, you already won the fight. Jesus. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, I actually have to cough. That was unfortunate. There's a chest here. Let's grab that chest. I... <laughs> How chest give? Give chest now. Excellent. Uh, that's a boring. So there's not going to be much. Yeah, there's just money. Town records. I shall do it. What do we need for the town records? Notice too. I'm sure we look at that. All right, what's going on in here? What, what is? What is? Aha! Records of the Black Marsh. How the Baroness won her people's hearts. Ooh, toy horse. Boop. Item received. All right. You know, might as well continue the streak. Um. Oh boy. Okay, no, it's just that. All right. Some years ago, a dragon rampaged through the countryside, gorging herself on animals and people. Before long, she nested near the village of Black Marsh. Fearing she would drag off villagers to feed her young, we sent men to drive the beast away. The, the men were never seen again. The new Baroness had, till then, done little for her people. She emerged from her manor and told us not to worry. She'd been sent from Orlay not just to rule, but to protect. She promised the dragon would be gone by sundown the next day. She set off in the morning, alone. We were certain she'd gone insane. What chance had one woman against a dragon? At sundown, there came a loud clap like thunder. So great it shook the earth. Then our baroness returned to us, triumphant of the dragon. There was no sign. The Baroness, no longer aloof, sang and danced with the lower us. There were dark whispers that the Baroness was a witch. But we did not care. Her magic had saved us, and for that, we loved her. Yeah, and then, then she started taking young pretty girls from their homes and draining their blood and drinking it. Um, that caused some issue for some people. I don't know why anyone would ever get upset about that. Notice! Once this off the card reads, the village lies abandoned, may the maker rest their poor souls. Yeah. Maker never got a chance. But we'll get to that. Alright. <clears throat> I guess it's time to leave the town. We'll go out this way. There's Rashvine. I like Rashvine. More of the veil tears. It's like I'm being guided somewhere. Oh, good. More werewolves. Ooh, hidden clue. It looks like something ghostly. Uh huh. Almost like uh -huh. a fade. Really? Alright, whatever. Another dead, uh. dead darkspawn. Ooh, rocks. Hidden clue. Fish light. Oh, good. Found you. And split you in half. There's at least two more, according to my radar. And boop. Oh. That looks like it might have hurt. <clears throat> Alright. Hidden clue. With cold dead eyes, the dragon gaze on your prize. Okay, Mark of the Divine. It's not terrible. I have use for that. Rocks. Ah, Kristoff's locket. That'll come in handy if I ever find Kristoff. Can I go down here? I can. Ah, the ripped page. What? Oh, yeah, sure. Come on. Boop, ba -doo -doo. Doo -doo. Hey, you got wolves with you this time. They'll put up an actual fight. <laughs> oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. Apparently the wolves are being weakened by being in your present shadow wolf. I know he's not 
but because of the angle there, it kind of looked like Anders was just stabbing them in the head with his staff. It's just the that's the pose he does for casting spells, but it's just like shank, shank, as the dang wolf's trying to nom on me. Oh, that's pretty great. I enjoyed that. Rip page. The very nice is secret. The veil is weak near the stone circle. Perhaps it's my rituals, but I suspect it's always been weak here. I feel traces of old, ancient magic. Maybe this is what drew me. I think the girls feel it, too. As we approach the circle, they sense something was wrong. With me? Did they fear me? Something about this place is changing them. Claiming them for its own. It is inconceivable. And using their blood to reinvigorate my me traps their souls in the fade. <sighs> Perhaps they become the same demons, ghosts, and spirit who invade my dreams. I... No, it doesn't matter. They are nothing, peasants. I am a baroness of Orlais. Yeah, there was a lot of treatment like that, and that's why the Ferelders, uh revolted and kicked all of you the fuck out. Deathroot and a giant hunk of dragon. Yoink. Oh, apparently, I didn't loot one of the piles of crap. My bad. Let me dig around in there. Ooh, a lyrium potion. What an odd shit you take. Um. Ah. Karsten's in cash. All right. There's a chest up here, so let's just and this way deal with these two. Oh no! It's an ambush. Who would have known? And spit and scream. Yeah, that laid a couple of them out. That was pretty neat. He just got a spin and scream. Spin and scream. Spin and scream. Just got a. Oh, okay. Boring. Uh, hey, when you get to the end game and you're still looting just useless crap off people, I mean, it's not like I expect every enemy to have a ama amazing heroic loot, but like, blah, like more than we find. Apparently, I missed clicking on this cot. To do that. Must have been Christoph Camp, but it's not been used for days. Huh. He's probably made another one, then, obviously. A doi. It's gonna go from there. Yeah, it is. We'll see more of that in the future. How the hell? Oh, I didn't go this way. That's right. And then we go over here. Look, the hidden cache. Um. Desire demons. That's right. They're not called lust demons. It's close to it, though. Well, we had some jewels and a single gold. Can I just loot the box, please? Probably doesn't even have anything I want in it. I'll leave if you let me look at it. And if I do want it, I'll, I'll just kill you. But if I don't, ah, fuck it, I'll just kill you and take it anyway. I don't care. Sharpshooter. I'm assuming that means uh, one of my archers has gotten a lot of really good kills. Nathaniel there is doing a good job. Sounds like... Boop. Uh -huh. And what's in the box that they were protecting? Skull Crusher! And the recipe for greater elixir of grounding. Alright, alright. You know, that's not the end of the world. Skull Crusher, how are we doing? Hmm, chance to stun's nice. I'm sorry. Daisy Cutter is telekinetic? What? Since when is that a thing? What? What does that mean? I have arrows of filth. Let's equip that. Um. I'm still trying to process that it's telekinetic. I'll get there. I swear. Ugh. Let me just turn it around for Mark of the Divine. 
I might give that to Augie. Augie does need to have equipment as well. You never know when I might end up being forced into a situation where I need to use him too. So let's see what this telekinetic weapon is. Oh, I'm currently wielding it. Perfect. What makes it telekinetic? Nothing. Is that why it looks like a two-handed axe? Is that what the telekinetic... Because it looks almost identical to Frenzy here. Why am I not attacking anything? I don't know. Yeah, it looks like Frenzy. Is it just Frenzy, but... But with the ability to be wielded one-handed? What? Did you say we've never seen... We fought a bunch of them in the... Never mind. I'm asking the wrong questions. They just broke some prompts, I think. Uh, they guess they expect you to go to the Black Marsh first. I think it does... Re they, the game does recommend that, I'm pretty sure, to go after Kristoff. Uh, hey, we found him. Um... But... They should still... Would have seen the other stuff. Yep. Yeah, what does that? You leveled up. Uh, b b uh, strength? No, dex. Uh, you can use more con. You can use more mana. Stamina. Stamina. There it is. Unending flurry. Beautiful. What is in bucks? Oh, we already did bucks. Alright. Well, <sighs> hello, corpse. What's up? Sure, this will be fine. Nothing weird's gonna happen here. Yep, that's, uh, very deceased corpse. Hmm. And, uh... Ah, that's one of them talkers. That is your gray ward. Mm. The mother told it to me that if he was lured to this place and slain, that in time you would come. Uh -huh. mother, she was right. Oh, that's a good thing. Ah, right. uh, I don't know about that. <clears throat> she wanted me to come to ambush me, I suppose. An ambush, an attack, yes. This here, it is no attack. I here before you is the first, and I am bringing to you a message. Uh huh. Mother, she is not permitting you to further his plan, whether this you know or not. So she is sending you a gift. Is it refundable? I don't want to deal with the poison space anus. Get, get the green space anus away. What did the green space anus do? Why am I loading? <laughs> That's concerning. Where has... Oh, now the game's not responding. That's actually concerning. Okay, okay, we're back. We're back. Um, that... <sighs> am I in the veil? No. We have come yeah, to fade. That's, that's right. Cannot be this. Oh, well, it is. Oh, sorry. Right. Um. Uh. You weren't first in your class, I take it. His name's First. I am afraid. Now I am being trapped in the fade with you. I am the fool. Uh, let's take revenge together. The Grey Warden is wishing help. From the first, do not be making me laugh. I will be leaving you to the children. I will be finding my own path back into the world. Back to the mother. Okay, buddy, you have fun with that. I'll kick your ass later. Um, but for now, spin. Scream. Oh, God, get it off me. It's touching me in places with its little grubby fingers. Seriously, can, it, can somebody do enough damage to make this thing stop gnawing on my face? It's very rude. 
Alright, you. I'm mad now. No, no. No, 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 no. No, you don't run away from me. You don't run away from me. That's a lot of red. My minimap for shows a lot of things. Chicken! Perhaps. Well, I mean, we destroyed three brood mothers. So. What? Who? As you say, I have lost the spell. Ah. So what does the Legion do when you, you know, Lesser shade. Well, good time to start that conversation, I guess. Spider. Alright, well, you guys all suck. I guess I'll just stand here and beat up a bunch of you. Spin! Scream! Oh, I can't scream. I don't have enough stamina. Well, oh, oh, greater shade. There's the good stuff. Well, there's the mediocre stuff. Alright, let's loot the shades. Because I did discover an item that I couldn't afford in the shop that I, uh, I might actually want. Can I not pass through here now that I... Oh, I can. Hello, Desire Demons. I'd like it if you didn't. Oh. Well, alrighty then. Field tear. Can't do this one combat. Your actions are the fate of an effect on the physical world. Okay. I think I just made a chest up here right here that uh, I can get to once we go back. Essence of Constitution? Hell yeah! Uh... Hell yeah! It's like, wait, is there anyone else I want to give a plus one to con to? No. No, just me. Uh, well, I think we can go this way without ending up in town. Hello? You look like you need to die! Let me assist! And then I scream! Okay, I killed the game. Hold on, as I reboot Dragon Age, because I apparently screamed too hard. My bad. Uh, game please? There it is. I could hear it, but I couldn't see it. Oh, please tell me the last auto save is at least after the first sent us through the rift. Uh-oh. If it crashes this time. Whoa, boy! Alright, so not... We was right after the first walked off on the sound. So let me just get back to where we were. If I can. <sighs> Alright. Well, the game apparently doesn't want to be played right now. So I'm going to end the episode here. And uh, in the next episode, we're going to find out, we're going we're to continue uh, from just past where the desired demons are. I'm going to get to that point off camera again and save. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. But for now, please have yourselves a wonderful night.